Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I have a Spellbinders haul and I also have a peachy cheap uh, mystery bag. On uh, Black Friday I got an email that they were having a $16 mystery bag and I've never gotten a peachy cheap uh, mystery bag before so I'm kind of excited about that one, um, but I'm going to go ahead and start with the uh, Spellbinders. So first, for the Spellbinders, I'm a club member. And uh, for December, I received the Amazing Paper Grace die, which is uh, that slater. I really wanted to uh, make this sleigh and probably put some candy in there and, and give them away to my friends. So I thought that would be cute because it's like a 3D sleigh. So there's that. Oh yeah, see they have it here with the little flowers. I like the way they made it there with the gold. Okay, next, uh, Spellbinders had their pre-holiday sale where everything was, like, super reduced. Well, at least the items that I got. I shopped in the dollar section, and then I picked up a couple of other things from the clearance section. So I'll go ahead and start with, with that. Um, so first... From the dollar section, I picked up these Home for the Holiday stickers. I just thought these are super cute. There's only four in there, but for a dollar, that's, that's a good deal. Uh, I'll probably paint them or do something cute with them. I really like this yarn ball. It's like a sheep in a yarn ball. It's funny. So there's that. Next, I got these Frame It Foil stickers. I'm not sure what I'll do with these, but I kind of went a little crazy on the dollar stuff. They're nice. Probably use them for embellishments. Uh, next, I had seen people haul these before when they've had sales, and I went ahead and picked them up. It's these sequins, and uh, they get quite a bit, actually. These were dollars as well, and uh, you get quite a bit. These are summer. <laughs> they reminded me of some summer paper I have, so I also picked them up in the yellow and green. So yeah, thought that was nice for a dollar. Next, I got these cute little bows. Super cute, they're like double layered. I'm not good at making bows, so every time I could buy them nicely made, I, I try to pick them up. So there's that. I picked up two of these because I thought they were like super cool. I love bling. <laughs> so that's why I picked. I wish I would have picked up one more, but I didn't. I only thought I only need two. <laughs> Next, I picked up these enamel flowers. Super detailed these flowers. I don't know if you can tell, but there's that. Excuse my hands, guys. I was painting ornaments with my with my kids and the paint won't come off my hands, so I apologize for that. 
next I got these these jingle bells I was so happy to find these uh, rose gold jingle bells uh, this is something that I'll probably hoard try not to use um, because I like them so much so uh, I picked up these then I picked up some more uh, twinkle trim is what they are calling it and I got this in the gold and silver this one's a little bit thinner than the other one and uh, I think this was a dollar fifty but it's still an awesome deal so you get a, quite a bit in here I'm trying to see uh, 10 yards each wow that's a lot Then I went ahead and picked up these cute little trees. I'll use these next year for something, but oh my gosh, they're so cute. I'm not sure what I'll use them for, so if you guys have any ideas, let me know. But look at this. How cute is this? So I picked up two of these. embellishments and I picked them up for the hot air balloon and the camera and also because they were a dollar you can't beat that and they even come in their little box so I thought that was super nice I also picked up a couple of dies And, uh, oh, here, I'll show you guys these first. I picked up these flowers also. I got these butterflies. And these hoops. I also picked up this bag of, uh, pom-poms, but I didn't realize they were going to be this tiny. They're super cute, though. Like, super tiny. I also picked up these little flowers. And some of these were uh, like $2.75 or something. I think it was only this and these flowers here. No, these are super pretty. I also picked up these uh, boxes. I thought these would be nice to have. Um, I've picked these up before. Last time they had a sale. And I actually have one here put together so you can see what it looks like so this is a repurchase so these are nice for friend mail or for a quick little gift and you get 10 in a pack and these were also a dollar I also picked up these uh, treat twisters I have a die that's just like this, but it's, sometimes it's nice to have stuff already made. And they have a few colors in here. And you get 12 pieces. I also picked up this Goho tin. I like the little leaves. That's one of the reasons I picked it up for the little leaves. I also got these passport folders. They're just like little pre-made folders. 
and you get 10 in a pack. I thought those were cool. I also picked up these puffy stars. That's also a repurchase. I've bought those before. I got another set of the enamel flowers. And I got these super cute tag clips. I also got these little flowers. And with these, I, I'll put like a little pearl or something in the middle. Um, they're kind of plain, but I'm sure you, I could even like change the color of them. Some alcohol markers, because I think I like paper. So there's that. I love the packaging for these stars. Can we use it? I also picked up these snowflakes. I'm going to go ahead and open these, because I was curious about these. And I'm loving snowflakes right now. I'm not sure why. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's almost like they don't want me to open it. Okay, <laughs> sorry. Wow, these are pretty. Nice. If I would have known they were this shiny and pretty, I would have picked up two because these were also a dollar. And I, I checked yesterday to see if stuff was still on sale. Uh, so that sale is no longer going on. But... I did see that these were still in the clearance section. They're still a dollar. So I might go back on there. I also picked up, uh, I had been wanting these palette pastels, the Jane Davenport. Uh, they were $4.50. And I waited a long time to buy these because they would not go on sale, but they finally did. I think these are usually somewhere around $20, so for $4.50, I went ahead and picked them up. I also picked up the uh, like the skin tones, but I guess I'll be getting those in separately. I don't know why they didn't send them in this package. Kind of interesting to see pastels this way. So I went ahead and picked those up because I love Jane Davenport and every time I could get something of hers on clearance I do. And I also got these blenders. I paid four dollars for these and uh, yeah I really thought about paying four dollars for these because I thought they're just like eyeshadows eyeshadow uh, brushes, but I just went ahead and did it. And last, I actually have a few more things, not last. I picked up this twine and black licorice, and guys, this twine is really nice. I thought it was going to be smaller than this. So I was pleasantly surprised. It's thick. Nice. And then I picked up a couple dyes. Um, I picked up this gnome dye. He's so cute with the little mushroom. I got this pool with the view set. Um, this one was also on sale for $4.50, but the downside is that the stamp set that goes with it was regular price. 
so I didn't want to pick that up, but I'll just wait. It eventually, hopefully, it'll go on sale. Um, if not, I'll just find a different way to use it, but uh, yeah, there's that. Then I found uh, these cookie exchange dies, and I think these were $2. Uh, you also need stamps for these, but I figured these I can use them without the stamps because uh, they're just like cookie shapes, so that's why I picked these up. I want to see how big they are. They're not very big. But I got a good deal, so. I love these green dies from Fun Stamper's Journey. And I also picked up this baby bow die. Oh, I also picked up this uh, Halloween uh, like chipboard stickers. I just thought that guy was so cute. And then I picked up, up my Happy Place die set. And this is just shapes uh, and you could put something together. I saw it put together a few different ways. I thought this was going to be a little bit bigger, but if I, I'll figure something out. But they're just shapes anyway, so you could use them for a lot of different things. And lastly... Uh, I had been eyeing this one, but again, I waited for it to go on sale. It's this cute little backpack, and this is the small die of the month um, for August 2019. And there's that. So now for the PG Cheap um, mystery bag. been waiting for this guy. I'm not sure I'm showing my address. Alright, so let's see. Oh, first is this Jen Hatfield scallop tape. It's nice. I don't know if you could see the scalloped edge. Then there's this American Crafts uh, Journal Studio sticker book. Nice. 1,547 stickers. Wow. That'll last me a long time. Then there's this uh, journal. It's just a cute little pineapple journal. I like things like this for a friend now. Next is this Echo Park stencil. How cute is that with the little flags? Next is these uh, oval embellishments. You know what? There's more than one in here. Oh wow, there's three. That's nice. I'm building up a stash for a giveaway, so some of these are going in there too. Another washer tape. It's like fabric tape. Hmm. 
here is a six by six paper pad, one of a kind. And this is from my mind's eye. Let me so I could show you guys. Oh gosh. They're all so cute. Oh, look at that. This is a nice paper pen. I like it. And there's this Happy Turkey Day stamp set. I don't have any Thanksgiving stamp set, so that's nice. Here's these. Prima flowers. Some enamel dots. More adhesive gems, and this is cute. Here's this sticker sheet. Some page flags. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Let's see what else I could pull out of here. Some super cute paper clips. Then there's this pack of stickers, but it feels like there's more than one in here, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Just different colors. Yeah. Thanksgiving. Halloween. Halloween. Oh, they're different. Wow, that's a lot of stickers put some of these in the giveaway too. Okay. Next is the simple story floral bits and pieces. I like those flowers. And then there's these uh my mind's eye uh, cityscapes mixed bag 40 pieces oh this is cute this will be cute for my grandson's scrapbook Aww. nice and last but not least there is a galaxy marker in white let's see Oh, and it works. Hmm. Well, that was a really good bag for $16. Um, I'm happy I was able to get one. Uh, I guess they sell out pretty quick. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I have a couple more hauls I would like to share. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.